Hey, how's it going, everyone? I'm Siju. Welcome back to Grim's Hollow. Let's play part two. Well, anyways, today we'll be exploring the cave and hopefully find Timmy. Let's go down here. No, oh no. What? Oh, Alright, it's a fight. I will destroy them. Uh, sigh. <laughs> yes. Okay, I don't want to be dead because someone's sighing about me. Okay. That, that, that's just too cringe. Great, one shot at it. Another one shot there. Nice. Too easy. Uh, can I avoid it? Yes, I can. I don't want to. Do they respawn? No. Then fin let's finish it anyways. Hey. Jesus, stop! Alright, there we go, finally. Got him! There's a note there. Please note that ghost caves sometimes have ghost walls. These are illusionary walls which hide secrets and secret entrances. Whatever. You can make them disappear by facing the wall and pressing Z. Alright. Try not to get lost. Grim. Heard there was a ghost wall around here. But I've poked and prowled this wall with my sight, and nothing's happening. Alright. Okay, there's a... Uh... What? Here? There you go, genius. Seedew strikes again. I can't go in. Oh, I did. There's the shield goes now. Jerry! <laughs> Alright, Jerry, you're the first one. Going to destroy. Which is special. Here's... I don't have the thing. And so... Oh, so I do have to deal with Jerry first. Alright. This gloomy spirit lowers your willpower to a sulky sigh. There's not much keeping them from passing out though. Fine. Alright, same thing. So basically I have to take him out first. Perfect. No, 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 don't attack. Can I eat something? Excuse me. Please. <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm dead. Great. Let's do all of that again. Hey, you passed out in there. Looks like that ghost you fought gave you a rough time. It goddamn did. 
Remember to eat when you're in danger. Sounds silly, but it works, hey? Fine. I'll eat. Eat. Ah, they respawn when I die. I yeah, might as well await them. <laughs> Since I'm a pro gamer. I'm gonna catch a cherry. Ah, just miss a bubble, but. Ah, stop sighing. Damn those. There you go, get that cherry. Good trick. Just one shot. Bruh, I'll use a special kill. Skill, I mean. Ooh, I'm here now. Where? Hey there. You brought the Reaper with the butt of your stick. <laughs> Alright. Uh. Huh? Did I pass out? Oh no, that means I'm late. I'm supposed to be at the bakery. Thank you so much for finding me. Here's a reward for your trouble. Three dead delicious donuts and two spooky cookies. Amazing. Spooky cookies, goddammit. How do I get there? Snorer? Seems like Snorer lacks. Uh, I'll observe first. No, 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 no. Not so. Oops. Look at it. It's sleeping peacefully. Hit the tunnel, and you'll likely be on the receiving end of their fury. <laughs> uh, you're not being in any help, game. 35 willpower? Jesus, that's the highest I've ever faced. Didn't wake up that guy. I'll go down first. Don't want to fight that thing. Well, let's just fight him anyways. Now this looks different. Oof. That's some damage, bro. Oh, I one shot it. Okay, let's heal up a bit. That's enough. Oh no, Jerry! Not again. Oh no, I should touch him. No, no, no. I'm not going to go. Oh, why? I, I thought I killed it. Ugh. Waking up again. Come on. Let me just await them like how I await my responsibilities. Not here, right?
let's go down here now uh, <laughs> it turned straight into me okay Oh my god, what the? Jesus, you're the case. <laughs> sorry, sorry, uh, it's trying to go again. I'm trying to go again. Stick has failed. Ah! Oh, thank you for finding me. I was chasing down a ghost, but it disappeared. And so did the exit. <laughs> that sneaky ghost led me into an ambush. Ah! Here's a reward for your troubles one delicious donut and one spooky cookie. Goddamn spooky. Alright. Uh, is that all? Uh, that's all. I don't want to fight you. But I'll do it anyways. First observe. This ghostling is really the worst part of it all. Dirty, alright. So basically, let's take care of the ghostling first. Perfect. Yeah, finally, the story is it's on the field. It's okay. It's okay. The ghost faded away. Alright, moving on. No, no, uh... What's that thing? I can't do it. Alright. Uh, I need to eat. I could have sworn there was an entrance around here the other day. Well, you're too dumb to see it. This is right. <laughs> it is too obvious. Timmy, where are you? Lavender, is that you? Timmy! Lavender, hold on. I'm coming to you. Oh no. oh no, you're not. Do you remember me? We met not too long ago at the inn. Well, I wouldn't think you'd care. You just dreamed a dozen ghosts like me. Err, uh, thanks for your help. But I'd like to collect my brother. Collect. That's a nice word for reap. Ha! Huh? No, I should have never helped you. You're just like the other reapers. I just want to take my brother and go home. Let me throw. No, you've done enough harm. You're not reaping him. If it's the last thing I do. Hurry. I'm just going to take my own needs. I'm just going to take No, no, no. 
finally. You're dead, Barry. You're dead to me. I'm a god of death. What's with your eyes? Lavender? Are you okay? Yeah. You can be a ghost. Tell me. Lavender. Ah. Oh. Why are you crying, Lala? Tin? Yeah? inside my pocket and whatever you do to not come out until I say so. Statements were invisible or otherwise I don't know if I can protect you. Is that clear? Okay. It's just me passing through it. Like that. Nothing suspicious whatsoever. Oh my god. There you are, where were you? I was worried sick. Figurative display of speaking, that is. I can't be sick. <laughs> Asshole. Uh, I went for a walk, wanted to stretch my legs. I see. Well, now that you're up, I may as well invite you for tea. I don't suppose you mind walking a bit further. I don't know why I made it. British accent for him, but okay. I want to rest first. Yeah, I'll go have tea. There's no harm with having tea, of course. Excellent! So that I, he won't suspect me of hiding a ghost. Duh. So, Lavender, which of these treats are your favorite? Is it a cookie or a cake? Are you into muffins or donuts? The baker is dying to know. Wait, that's not the correct word. Pardon me. Of course, he's dead. He's eager to know. Cookie, cake, donut, muffin. I love cake. Let's go with cake. Good taste. That too is my favorite. Mr. Grimm, I've got a question. No need for formality. You can call me Grimm. Ask away. Can a ghost or a reaper ever live again? No. Unless... Unless... They had a soul. I don't understand. Don't we have souls? No, I'm afraid you're all just spirits. There's a difference. When you die, your soul disintegrates. Because you don't need it anymore. All that's left is spirit, which can, which makes you either a ghost or a reaper. But every now and then, there are beings who arrive here with a soul completely intact. Normally when this happens, I redirect them back to life. This is a rare occurrence, however. Anyways, more oolong tea? Yes, please. Oolong tea, it smells nice. Do you have any more questions? Are you a car? I, I, I really wonder how did I die so... I don't know that, I'm afraid. I don't see anything which happens on earth. Alright. Are you a god? Why were you mad about balloons? Yes, there you go. I always wanted to know what's the deal with balloons. Haha, <laughs> you may remember that? Well, I wanted to throw the party first. I was going to set up balloons in this room right here. But when I locked, looked in the closet, all of the balloons were gone. <laughs> Alright. 
what happens after I pass on, huh? My case is as good as yours. I never seen the afterlife. Only deliberate spirits do it. Okay, final question. Are you a god? No, I'm certainly not. As far as my powers go, I can teleport a certain distance. And I can read codes very well. But other than that, mm, I can do a lot of things. I can bake, for example. Such an amazing thing. Food. Alright, that's it. Alright. You know, usually Reapers don't tend to believe any of this is real. If they do, they start assuming we're a cult. I'm not sure why. <laughs> I would revise well with that outfit. <laughs> Maybe it's the masks. But it seems you've taken to the idea rather quickly. That's because I saw Timmy as a ghost after that. And so I rather I feel rather concerned. Does he know? What are you trying to say? Simply whether you are all right, Lavender. I care about all my reapers, yourself included. Thanks, Grim. Am um, I all right, really? Very well. Baker, you didn't need to sneak into my closet for ingredients, you know. But you looked busy and I was running out of flour. Why would you like... How would you like teaching Lavender to read? I mean, I would like to help. But you know, I don't fight Grim. You're better off asking someone else. You won't have to fight anyone. What if they faint? You're the fastest person in the hollow next to me. You can run out of there carrying them. Well, okay. Excellent. Lavender, when you're ready, talk to the baker at the bakery. I'm going to put away the ingredients. See you later, Lavender. Alright, I can... I'll see his closet. Ah, yes. <laughs> Thank you for reminding me to lock the closet door, Lavender. I wasn't reminding you. I, was, I just wanted to have a sneak a peek, okay? I do not enjoy scolding people. What are you insinuating? <laughs> but I think I must be more firm about rapers wandering into my closet whenever they like. Fine. What's this? I mask. It's look. It looks incomplete. What about this? I wouldn't recommend going through there if I were you. That door is an interdimensional portal to a world full of ghosts so horrifying that you would not recover upon seeing them. Uh, why is it here? Ah, it's my morning shift. There are ghosts outside the hollow that must be dealt with. Fine, I'll, I'm leaving, Grim. I'm going. Are you not gonna say anything? Okay. I'll drink the tea first, thank you. Yeah, exactly. I'll finish my tea. Yours as well, if you don't mind. Yeah, me neither. You probably still put in that, but... Sis, I need to talk to you. You peek down in your hoodie pocket. What that guy said about having a soul. I had one too. But Timmy, everyone used to have that. No, but I had one when I arrived. What? I remember waking up in a cave. And when I looked down, I looked like a person. Like I used to. And everything was kind of gloom, glowy, like a greenish glow. But then other ghosts came into the cave and they were scary. And they started chasing me. So I started running. Then I blacked out. When I woke up again, I felt light. And I couldn't see myself. I think my soul is still here, Lavender. 
somehow I can feel it. Maybe that ghost took it. I believe you. I'll try and find it. Thanks, sis. Now, shush. I need to go. I look crazy if I'm caught talking to my pocket. <laughs> yeah. You look crazy anyways. <laughs> <laughs> you stick your tongue and immediately close your pocket. What do you mean, Jamie? I'm your sister. Well, guys, I think I'll end the video here. And see you in the next playthrough. Next episode, I mean. Yeah, anyways. See you in the next episode. Bye.